Hey guys, it's Tony Hunter Tony here with episode 118 of this week's top 10 hot comic books I found out in a while. These, this, these, this, these, or this is going to be something a little bit different. I've been wanting to share with you some of the cool books that I pick up. Uh, each week we go by and I, you have no idea what I read or what I collect. You just see some cool stuff that I find in the back stock. So I wanted to bring you this week a little bit something different. Um, it's not a bad haul. It's got some key books and some key issues, but fantastic reads that I want to share with you. Whew. Okay, I'm glad I got that out of my uh, out of my uh, vocabulary, out of my face. I had to get my face to say it properly. It's like my third take. Uh, it's uh, uh, this is pre-recorded. Uh, this won't be live. So you won't be able to comment on me. Uh, so you can make fun of me and the comments after the video is made. And by that time, I've calmed down a lot. Guys, I want to say congratulations to Bradley uh, McConaughey. Did I say that right? He is um, he is the winner from one uh, 100 comments from episode 100. Uh, when we were celebrating our, our 100th episode, that was one of my giveaways. And we hit that 100 comments, and I put them in a randomizer and came out for the winner. Bradley, congratulations. Bradley is in South Africa. Holy cannolis. That's going to be the farthest place I have ever sent free stuff to. Uh, guys, just so you know, um, I had a Canadian winner, uh, and now I have a South African uh, winner. Um, if you guys are not in the States and you want to win one of my free giveaways, uh, the items will come to you free. Uh, shipping in the continental United States is free up to $15. Anything over $15, uh, you have to cover that cross cost to ship it to you. So my followers and my friends that have won, they've agreed to cover the difference. I appreciate that. I am sending them out some uh, good stuff, and uh, hopefully they'll they'll get it soon, and I can share that with you as soon as I know that they've received it. Whew. All right, let's get uh, let's get going. Hey guys, uh, I wanted to say uh, Jim Hesker. It's a shout out. He quoted a nice list of comics. This is and tribute to George Perez. I think that was from our last episode. Thank you, Jim. I appreciate that. And Eric Williams, nice job with three cameras. <laughs> Thank you. Trying to get better. And uh, love the John Byrne and George Perez stuff as well. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. All right. There's my shout outs and my, uh, oh, by the way, all my contests. Uh, there's no, uh, no way uh, sponsored, endorsed, or associated with YouTube and or any other social media platforms that it, which it may be promoted on. All right, I got that out of the way. Let's get into this week's top 10. So this week's number 10. Oh, look at that. I don't want it to be too shiny. Here, let me get it down here. I'll put it down there. That is a beautiful book. Uh, that is, oh, hi again. Uh, let me get down to the solo thing. That is a beautiful Rob Lee field cover. Uh, I, wa I like this one. I, I had to grab it. Uh, I am a Moon Knight subscriber, but I did get this variant cover because I thought this was really cool. Um, the pricing is not important this week. It, it does have a $5, uh, five aftermarket value, which is above cover. So that's good. These books are, are ones that I wanted to share with you and let you know that I really like them. All right, and then also our, our local comic shop, Acme, has got Rob Leefield on June 11th. Um, he will be there for signing uh, books and uh, meet and greet, and um, that's really cool. I'm going there to meet him, and I'm taking my uh, New Mutants 98s to go get signed by him. I, 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 think, I think it will be worth it. All right, there we go, number 10. Look at that. All right, let me get back up here. Uh, number, um, let me get the next one in here. Sorry, guys. Got to get used to it. It's hurting my head. Number nine, this is Hulk. This is Hulk. I went right to Solo. This is Hulk number seven. And what the significance is, this is the uh, Scott Campbell uh, cover. It's a variant cover. This book is just insane. It, you've got... Celestial Hulkbuster armor, Tony Stark, kicking a crap out of an overpowered Hulk, out of control Hulk, versus a gamma. Ir, 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 how do you even, how do you even say that? Let's get that real close. 
I want to get that real close. Irritated? Ir 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 irritated? Ir I can't even say the word. Help me out down in the comments. Irradiated? 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 Ah, uh, yeah, maybe like a radiator. Uh, no, he's, uh, yeah, uh, Hulk, Hulk is uh, exuding so much gamma that uh, the Thor is affected by it. This, this, uh, this banner of war is huge. I got it back there in that cover. I told you this was going to be a big storyline. That is one of the hottest reads uh, this week. That's the first thing I grabbed to read. But uh, it's number nine this week uh, for my top ten. And that is a great find for five dollars. Loving that one. Uh, oh, hey, look at that. See, uh, my live stream isn't working here. Let me go back to that wall board. All right, my next book. Oh, I'm going to love this one. This is, hey, this is uh, Vampirella uh, Dracula. It is Unholy, issue number six. This book right here has got a cover of Rose Besh. She is the hottest artist uh, out there, and her work isn't bad also. Uh, no, literally, she is, she is fantastic. Love her work and uh, wanted to share that with you. It's a great read and really cool art. All right, let me get out of here. I got to get more fluid here. I got I got a lot to live up to. William said I was doing my th three camera stuff really smoothly and well. And, but uh, I'm having a hard time. You got to basically get into it. All right, look at this. This is number, uh, what is this, number seven? <laughs> that is strange, number three. That is a variant cover by Peach Momoko. Uh, she is awesome. I was on the Peach Bandwagon two, three years ago. I love her work, and now I uh, that Rose Besh. I definitely re recommend picking her, picking her work up when you can. But let's get to Peach Momoko. So Clea is the, the new Doctor Strange after the death of Doctor Strange. Uh, I'm pretty sure he'll come back. But this book right here is a beautiful Peach Momoko cover, and it's got a value of seven dollars. That's not bad for aftermarket being. Uh, what is it this week? The problem is is I've got some of this week's and last week's books in together And I wanted to present to you some of the stuff that I thought was really nice That's so nice <laughs> All right, see here's here's the deal, right? So I got to show you the book. Isn't that beautiful? Uh, it's so shiny, but it's it's the lighting's different in here So I got to put it down there put it in the solo uh, I'll get better transitions, I swear. This is Ghost Rider number three. Uh, this is a Peach Momoko variant. That is a beautiful, beautiful cover by Peach. This is a Stormbreaker variant. And uh, this new series is heating up as we speak. And it's got a great value, second, secondary value of $7. Look at that. That's number six. That's what I was forgetting to do. All right, we're going to get into... Uh, we're going to get back into uh, our Tony's Target. And if you don't know what Tony's Target is, it's something I set my sights on and I hunt for it. And then when I find it, I want to share it with you as I throw it around. This week's uh, new release is Miles Morales' uh, Spider-Man. And it is issue number 38. And the importance of that, which I'll try not to blind you. The importance of this issue, this is cover A. Uh, this has got his sister who is uh, uh, Billy Morales, and she is the Spider Slayer. She is from a another, uh, another multiverse, right? Another universe, and she's coming into where Miles is, and I think she wants to kill him. This is a really great story. Definitely recommend picking this one up. It is her first um, appearance as a grown woman. She was a baby in an earlier issue, but that's not a great, that's not a bad find. For a seven dollar aftermarket of cover A, man, let's go. Smoother transitions, Tony. That's that's the one I wanted to bring to your attention, guys. I want to say it's halftime. Thanks for watching me here on YouTube. I appreciate that. Where each week I'll bring you the top ten hot comics, action figures, and collectibles that I can find and want to share with you. I'll see you. They will be on YouTube for one week. After one week, I will. Uh, Put them on my Instagram channel uh, where they will be up for uh, purchase, right? So my YouTubers will get a one-week priority, and then Instagram 
we'll get the follow up and it'll be there for everyone to get a hold of. Just wanted to let you know. And then, guys, I want to get right back to it. I don't want to run over time this week. But the next one, ah, next one is going to be issue number five. Look at that. Ah, it's too shiny way up here. That is a beautiful book. This is another uh, Miles Morales Spider Man. That is cover B. That is a, a, a solo picture of his sister, Bailey Morales, the Spider Slayer. That one's got an aftermarket value right now. It's kind of hot at $10. Definitely recommend picking that up, not only for the read, but for the value. It's not bad for a new book. The next book that I'm looking at is, this is issue number four of, this is Darth Vader, Star Wars Darth Vader. I dropped it right in the slow, solo area. This is the first cover appearance of the Bad Batch. They just dropped the trailer for the new Badge Bat Badge Bat. Ah, Bad Batch second season on Disney Plus. That is insane. That is gorgeous. And I can't wait to see that. I really enjoyed the first season of Bad Batch. Definitely recommend watching that if you can. Let's get that one right there. That has got a great aftermarket value currently at $10. That was number four. All right, let's do number three. Number three is, oh, this one's awesome. <laughs> number three is Amazing Spider-Man. This is issue number two. It's the 60th year anniversary, and it has got uh, Gwen dressed up in her Spider-Man costume, sw swinging in a, a web swing. That is a really sweet-looking cover, and it's, it's actually doing really well. I've seen as high as 15 right now, but a good average price is 10 bucks. Definitely recommend picking that one up. And that was number three. All right, let's get to number two. Number two this week. Oh my goodness, this is awesome. Let me just drop that down in there. That is called The Closet. This is a uh, story written by Tinian the Fourth. It is a new horror story. It is hot right now. Right now, $10 easy. I've seen it as high as 20 maybe pushing it but fifteen dollars a good get but at ten bucks you can't beat it definitely recommend picking this one up that is by image comics that is beautiful and that is our number two this week and we get down to our number one uh look at that oh uh, you know what that is right that is a design variant of you guessed it, a Miles Morales Spider-Man, number 38. That is Billy Morales, his sister, known as the Spider Slayer. That that copy right there is worth $15 right now. Definitely worth picking that up if you can find it. All right, let's get to it. We are down to our bonus book. And every week you know that I have a bonus book. This week's bonus is no different than any other week. It is something really cool. I want to show this to you. Oh, look at that. This is Avengers Forever number six. This is the first appearance and cover appearance of Vibranium Man. Let me get that down in there for you. Avengers Forever is, is doing really well. I love this story. This is this, this is the book that I read right after I read the Hulk. Uh, Avengers Forever is definitely worth picking up. And this is a really cool book. And it's already going for $15.00 as we speak let me put that up on the wall for you as our bonus book let you look at those bad boys for one more second and then i will tell you that this week's hunt on our new release is oh i, I had my total there it is right there where'd it go oh it's over here 106 dollars that is not bad right for new books to be uh, already have the value like that all right cool all right, I'll get better at this. I swear I will. Guys, I want to say thank you for joining me. Uh, next week's episode, I will have some uh, ratio variants. And then the episode after that, I'll be doing some really cool uh, Walmart packs that I found. But I'll get to that in a couple of days. Hey, guys, I'm going to be dropping videos mo uh, Monday night, Wednesday night, and Friday night. Uh, it's just the way it's going to be. I'm not going to try to do them at midnight the night before. I'm just going to come in Monday, Wednesday, Friday and drop a video. And then I will set up a new live stream, uh, hopefully coming up, in, uh, not th this week, but the following week. Because I want to say thank you, and I'll see you.
on the next hunt. All right, bye-bye.